All right, so behind me right here is the all new Chevrolet Traxxie 2024. This is the LS trim, your entry trim level. Let's go have a look. All right, so as I mentioned, of course, the LS trim is synonymous with your entry trim level when it comes to the Chevrolets, but this one has a host of features despite it being an entry trim level, but let's start off with the price. 21,500 US dollars for this Chevy Trax LS, which I think is a steal when we talk about all the things it includes. But let's start underneath the hood. The, underneath the hood, we're talking about a 1.2 liter, three cylinder turbo, producing about 137 horsepower, pretty torquey little unit as well. As far as the dimensions of the vehicle, it has definitely changed from the outgoing model. More sleek in the roof line, it's definitely shorter. It's 11 inches longer and it's two inches wider than the previous generation. Now, one of the main changes, unfortunately for my, some of my Canadian friends, is the fact that there is no all-wheel drive offering. It's only gonna be available in the front wheel drive. Get yourself a good set of snow tires though, and I think you're gonna be very impressed with what this can do, especially at that entry you know, price level that I'm talking about. Heading to the back, six feet more overall cargo space in this cubic feet, pardon me, more cargo space in this than the outgoing model as well. And if we wanna keep talking dimensions, three inches more legroom here in the back. Now being it's an LS, of course, as you're gonna see, it does have the cloth interior in this one, but it has some character to it at least. It's not just plain. I like that kind of gray inset in there as well. But again, lots of space back here. Of course, these seats will drop down for that more space as well. Let's just shut this back here. Heading to the front, we're gonna see some nice features obviously here as well. Power windows, power locks, all that kind of stuff, of course. I do like the blue that they've got here in the vents, of course. You're still gonna have air conditioning, cruise control, all that kind of stuff. It doesn't have the push button start, unfortunately, so it does have the key start, whatever. Uh, you do here have the eight inch screen. Some of the higher trim levels will have an 11 inch screen. Again, not a massive difference. And then you're gonna have your kind of black and white screen there uh, with your analog gauges, whereas the higher trim levels are gonna have a digital screen, but again, if you don't care about that stuff, that's where you're saving the money, right? Again, there's your HVAC controls and so on. All your steering wheel controls are still here. You're still gonna have Apple CarPlay, Android Auto, Google integration, a ton of things in this for what the price is. Great looking vehicle, a lot of space, a lot more space than the outgoing model. That is a 2024 Chevrolet Trax LS.